What do fish do in the winter? During these frigid winter days, you may wonder where aquatic creatures go. They don't make fires, they don't curl up with a good book and a cup of hot chocolate, just as we would do to get away from the cold. In order to sustain seasonal temperature changes, the fish living in the streams of Kentucky are very well adapted. In winter, fish descend to the bottom of streams and lakes where the cooler water is. The density of hot water is higher, allowing it in winter to fall to the bottom. This is the same explanation for floating in a bowl of water with ice cubes. Fish are cold-blooded or picolothermic, which means the temperature of their body varies with the temperature around them. Fish are less active during the cold of winter. They find little pockets where they can stand still and conserve energy from the way of fast-flowing water. They eat less as their metabolism slows, and they wait until the coldest period of winter. However, for anglers, winter offers the most critical opportunity. There are many types of fish that you can target during this time of the year. In comparison to the warm season, winter finds more fish searching for invertebrates and pinfish in the deeper grass of the shore. Here are a few saltwater fish that you can target during your fishing session in the winter. 1. Sheep's Head The sheep's head is a relative of the bream family and can also be easily identified by the five to six black stripes running horizontally to the body in addition to its muzzle. This is how it gets its other name. The fish that is accused. Sheep's head can be found hanging around jetties, pilings, and other obstructions, and hobbyist anglers have captured many of them off piers. They live all over the U.S. East Coast, too. Sharks. A number of sharks are searching for a meal during winter along the beaches on the coastlines. During this time, it is an excellent opportunity for anglers who can use it primarily as bait to target them. 3. Pompano. Pompanos are marine fishes in the Carangidae family in the genus Trichinidus. Pompano can also refer to various other members of the Carangidae, or the order Persiforms, that are similarly shaped. They are deep-bodied, toothless in appearance, with a forked tail and a narrow base. They are normally silvery in color overall, often with darker yellowish fins, and on the side of their body with one or a few black markings. They are relatively large fish, up to around 1.2 meters feet long, but not more than half or two-thirds of that size is reached by most species. They are found in warmer seas worldwide, often entering brackish waters as well. 4. Red Drum The red drum on the back is a dark red color that blends into white on the belly. Near the tail, the red drum has a distinctive eye spot and is somewhat streamlined. Currently, a three-year-old red drum weighs six to eight pounds. The largest red drum weighed just over 94 pounds on record and was captured on Hatteras Island in 1984. By vibrating their swim bladders, the male red drum makes a knocking or drumming sound during spawning. Adult red drums feed on crabs, shrimp, and mullet in the summer and fall. 5. Striped Bast The striped bast, also known as striped Atlantic bast, striper, linesider, rock or rockfish, is an anadromous perciform fish of the Moronidae family found primarily along North America's Atlantic coast. It has also been widely introduced throughout the United States into freshwater recreational fisheries. A separate strain referred to as Gulf Coast striped bast is striped bast found in the Gulf of Mexico. The striped bast are the Maryland, Rhode Island, and South Carolina state fish, and the New York, New Jersey, Virginia, and New Hampshire state saltwater, marine, fish. The history of the North American striped bast fishery dates back to the colonial era. The immense abundance of striped bast, along with aluives, traveling and spawning most rivers in the coastal northeast, is mentioned in many written accounts by some of the first European colonists. 6. Bonefish. Bonefish weigh up to 8.6 kilograms, 19 pounds, and measure up to 41 inch, 105 centimeters long. From very silver sides and slight darker backs to olive green backs that blend to the silver side, the color of bonefish can range. Slight shading on the scales also leads to very soft subtle lines that run from the gills to the tail, the flank of the fish. Sometimes the bases of the pectoral fins are yellow. 7. Snapper. Snappers are a family of Perciform fish, Lejanidae, primarily aquatic, but feeding in freshwater, with some members inhabiting estuaries. Around 113 species are included in the family. Some are valuable fish for food. The red snapper is one of the best known. Snappers share all of the seas in tropical and subtropical areas. Some snappers grow up to a length of about 1 meter, 3.3 feet, but one particular snapper, the Cubera snapper, grows up to 5 feet in length. Most of them are active carnivores, feeding on crustaceans or other fish, although a few feed on plankton. 
they can be kept in aquariums, but often develop too quickly to become common fish in aquariums. Most species live near coral reefs at depths exceeding 100 meters, 330 feet, although some species are found up to 500 meters, 1,600 feet deep. Snappers harbor parasites, as most fish do. 8. Cobia. The cobia has an elongated fusiform, spindle-shaped body and a large flattened head, reaching a maximum length of 2 meters, 78 inch, and a maximum weight of 78 kilograms, 172 pounds. The eyes are narrow, and the lower jaw reaches far beyond the upper jaw. The jaws, the tongue and the roof of the mouth, line the fibrous biliform teeth. And tiny scales, the body of the fish is smooth. With two deeper brown horizontal bands on the flanks, it is dark brown in tone, grading to white on the belly. During spawning, as they darken and the background color lightens, the stripes are more conspicuous. 9. Barracuda. A barracuda is a huge ray-finned predatory fish known for its frightening appearance and vicious behavior. The barracuda is a saltwater fish of the Sphorina genus, the only genus of the Sphorinidae family that was named of 1815 by Constantine Samuel Raffinesque. It is found worldwide in tropical and subtropical oceans, ranging from the eastern border of the Atlantic Ocean to the Red Sea, the Caribbean Sea on its western border, and the Pacific Ocean in tropical areas. Barracudas live at the water's top and at coral reefs and sea grasses. 10. Black Drum. The Black Drum, Pagonias cromus, also known as the Drummer Drummer, is like its counterpart, the Red Drum, a saltwater fish. In the Pagonias family, it is the only species. While most specimens are normally found in the range of 5 to 30 pounds, 2 to 14 kilograms, the black drum is well recognized as the largest of the entire family of drums, with some specimens exceeding 90 pounds, 40 kilograms, in excess. The black drum world record was just over 51 kilograms, 113 pounds. When juvenile fish have distinctive dark stripes over a gray body, they are mostly black and or gray in color. Well there you have it. 10 different fish to target during this cold winter season. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a thumbs up. Hit that bell notification and subscribe.